Kojiko and Kojiko Communications are involved in very exciting businesses. The company was started by our father in 1957, who opened a television station in Trois-Rivières, Quebec, then added a second one in Sherbrooke, Quebec, eventually bought a small cable system in Trois-Rivières. And when we went public with Kojiko uh, in 1985, we had $20 million in revenue. Since then, we've grown it to $2.3 billion with the help of the Toronto Stock Exchange, who has uh, provided financing along the way, which has enabled us to develop our cable holdings in Quebec, eventually into Ontario, now into the United States, as well as enter the data hosting and transport business in North America and Northern Europe. So it's a very exciting, dynamic business to be in, generates stable growth, high free cash flow, and we've been able to increase dividends year after year for a very significant period of time. The growth opportunities are on our, in our business are centered around very evolved services. For example, the, we can offer 120 megabits per second internet service now throughout our Canadian and American cable systems. We've also launched one gigabit per service in Connecticut and in Burlington Oakville uh, a few days ago in Burlington Oakville and we're now going to roll this out step by step throughout all of our franchise areas such that people will have available at their fingertips the best possible service. We have also launched the TiVo service three years ago and what it does, it, it allows our customers to scan everything that's available in the video world, whether it's our linear cable offering, our video on demand, recorded content, or over the top content. All of it can be searched and accessed by our customers. Uh, and this has enabled us to retain our customers a lot better and acquire new ones a lot easier. And of course, our services to businesses now are extremely evolved. We started with a basic phone line and internet, whereas today we offer hosted PBX services to people who no longer want to invest capital but want to pay per, tele per telephone set, uh, as well as we offer uh, SIP connections for people who want to keep their old PBX but want to be interconnected with us and go a further distance in terms of the services that are available to their staff. We also offer a wide area network, Ethernet over cable, over fiber. So these are all exciting services that generate new growth for our company. Well, our biggest challenge is to continue to evolve our cable systems uh, in an environment where competition is rising and where the uh, services are maturing. And the way to do that is to stay ahead of the curve all the time. Make sure that you always have the best television service available. Uh, one that through, for example, smaller packages, which we offer today, uh, act as a deterrent for people to cut off cable because now they can tailor the cable offering to uh, what they really want in addition to adding over the top, which our outstanding high-speed internet services allow them to do very easily. And of course we have our TiVo service, which is, uh, has added a new dimension. Once people start with the TiVo service, they really don't want to let go of it because of the immense possibilities as offers that I described earlier. In addition to being able to move the content from one room to the next into the home, and being able through a new application to actually access the content online whether when they're not, no longer at home. So it makes for a very exciting television experience. And in the business sector, I spoke about the services we offer, so that, that enables us to stay uh, many steps ahead of the competition. And uh, in our data hosting and transport businesses, we want now to take a better advantage of the fact that we are a full service provider. So whether it's co-location, hosting, cloud, data transport, managed services, we can offer the full bundle and 
What our challenge now is to make sure that we cross-sell these products to our various customers as well as acquire new customers. So the future looks exciting. Um, there's good growth ahead of us, good free cash flow growth, and of course good dividend growth. That's what we're, that's what we're working towards. The Toronto Stock Exchange for us has been absolutely fantastic. It has given us the freedom to do what we felt we wanted to do to grow the company in a profitable way. Uh, hence, access to capital has been available, will be available in the future as we continue on our journey, uh, which began 60 years ago, actually, and continues to evolve. Uh, and our job is to remain agile, seize new opportunities, uh, anticipate on technology, move in the right directions, anticipate customer needs, and the Stock Exchange has been a great partner uh, with us in achieving that.